Hello students. Today we are going to study about living things and non-living things. We will be completing this chapter in five different sessions. Today is the first session of the chapter. And after completing all the sessions of this chapter, you will be able to understand natural things and man-made things. You will be able to define living things and non-living things. You can differentiate between living things and non-living things. And also you will know the features of living things. The features of living things we will be going in more details in our coming sessions. So today we are going to discuss about natural things and man-made things. So natural things and man-made things. When we say natural things, that means that those things which are made by God and the man-made things itself, the name is made by man. So here we come across natural things are the things which are made by God and man-made things are the things which are made by man or human beings. Now let us take for example to make it more clear. Say for example this pen. Is this pen made by God? No. This pen is made by human beings or man. So this pen is, is it natural or man-made? Of course, this pen is man-made thing. So we will write it under this category. Let us take example of this tomato or such vegetables or fruits. Can human beings make these tomatoes? Can human beings uh, make the potatoes or mangoes or uh, these things? No. These things, these vegetables and fruits are made by God. So these vegetables and fruits are natural things. Vegetables and fruits are natural things. Let us take few more examples. For example, this mobile phones. These days we all are using the mobile phones. But you know this mobile phone is not made by God. This mobile phone is made by human beings. These mobile phones are made by man. So mobile phones are man-made things. Even the television at your home, the radios and your laptops, all these are made by human beings and they are called man-made things. Now, take for example, this stone. This stone is not made by man. This is made by God. So, stones and when the large size of stone is there, that we call it rocks. Stones, rocks, hills, mountains. These all are made by God and they are called natural things. So, stones. Also, you can say hills, mountains. These all are made by God. Now, you can also see a green plant over here. This plant is here. This green plant is over here. This plant is also created by God. We see all around us so greenery, so much greenery is there. All around us trees and plants are there. These trees and plants are the gift of God which is given to us. So these plants are made by God and they are called natural things. So all plants around us, they are the natural things. Now you are always studying the books. This book, is this book made by God? No, not at all. This book is made by human being. All the books, copies, notebooks, your instrument box, these all things are made by human beings. So we can say books are made by 
map. On the road we used to travel. The roads, bridges, your vehicles, car, motorbikes, buses, aeroplanes. All these are made by man. Aeroplane. Roads. Your school. Bridges. And so many other things. These all are made by man. And here you can take few more examples. Like at night we see stars in the sky. Stars are made by God. During daytime we see bright sun. That sun is made by God. Clouds are made by God. And so on. Birds, animals, fish. All these are the gift of God given to the human beings. And gift of God given to us on earth. The flowers, the butterflies, these are made by God and they are called natural things. So now I think you are very clear about what are natural things and what are man-made things. Now we, I will be writing the difference between these two very clearly. Before that, one very most important difference what you will find in this example you will see that uh, one, one such difference is there that all these man-made things, whether it is a pen, mobile, books, aeroplane, roads, schools, bridges, whatever it is, they all don't have life in them. They all are non-living things. Whereas the things which are made by God and are called natural things like Vegetables, fruits, stones, hills, mountains, plants, stars, sun and clouds and also man, human beings. on the board and you have to categorize it 
as natural things or man-made thing. Now, for example, let me make few drawings and you will find out whether it is a man-made or a natural thing. Is a fish. These are hills. A rat, bat, and ball. Book A bird Sun Stars Then for example a uh, road Now you have to categorize these pictures, these things as natural thing or man-made things. So this is your homework and we will be discussing the answer of this homework in the, our next session that is session 2. So now today you can go, you can sit at home and start doing the task.